Hey everybody, welcome back to Midnight Suns. We are doing it <laughs> with Deadpool. I said it. It's the deadliest sin. Having learned the location of the dreaded artifact known as the Magna Corrigo. Corrigo? Corrigo? Co-Rigo? Magna... Mag... Magna Corrigo. Probably something like that. The Midnight Suns must hurry to recover it. As expected. These vampires are getting out of control, <laughs> and it's all Deadpool's fault. Blah, blah, judgey, judge. Don't be so what? harsh on him, Sarah. He's super brave and super awesome and super handsome. Thou saveth my behind from foul beasts. Thou shalt henceforth have my undying devotion. Aw, oh, shucks. Really tickles the cockles of my heart. <laughs> we won't judge you. I don't even care that you're... Working for Dr. Doom? On my honor, in accordance with the mercenary code, I can neither confirm nor deny the identity of my client. You. Honor. At least tell us what this unidentified physician client hired you to find. <sighs> On my honor, in keeping with... No, wait. I can answer that one. A little something called the magma... Mana... Magna Carigo. That's it. You mean the vampire Holy Grail? I said that Holy one. Vampire. One of one of it's the things I said like was that. Blood sucking cousins believe will cure them of every weakness. Sunlight, silver, garlic breath. Finding it wouldn't be melodramatic. It would be cataclysmic. Unless you happen to be a vampire. And have you found it? This close. Tracked it to some backwards country full of mud, goats, and potatoes. Transia. Like, that's a thing. Transia. Why does it always have to be Transia? Mud? Goats? The Abbey is from Transia. So is one of the Midnight Suns. Love Transia. Love it. What's better than mud wrestling? Except goat wrestling, huh? And a huge fan of tater tots here. Stop talking. We have a relic to hunt. And I have the coordinates. Straight from my client's mouth. If he has one behind all that... Duh. Never mind. Okay. I, I don't know how they're going to top, like... I don't know how they're going to top Deadpool in the next DLCs, because he's just a character you could kind of go wild with. I, I don't foresee the next ones being as uh, humor-focused, but either way. What do we take here? Like, how, let's let's... Who do we take to let Deadpool... Shine. I'm kind of thinking Strange maybe would be cool. Uh, we saw him with Nico at one point. We saw him with Magic. Ghost Rider kind of needs to do his own thing. Hulk kind of needs to do his own thing. Iron Man, same. Uh, I think Captain America for the taunting could be really good, but he also might draw some attention. Uh... Same thing here, we could taunt away from Deadpool with Wolverine. I'm not sure. Let's take out let's take out Captain America and we'll put him in the we'll put him in the reds. Shall we? Do we have like a, a cooler do we have like a cooler do you have a cool red? That's not super red. Okay, well, I guess this is the coolest red we have. Actually, he might have had a default red that might be cooler. Yeah. Okay, well, either way, it's fine. Uh, so let's bring him. He, we need to check his cards real quick. My bad, my bad. We need uh, a couple things. We need the best defense. We need the shield bounce. Those are pretty much... That's pretty much what we need. Uh, yeah, that should be fine. Okay. That's not how I told you to dress. Is it? There we go. Okay, we're ready. Almost. What do we want to take here? What legendary? Maybe the uh, apply to vulnerable, the habanero dart would be good. Evil eye totem. 
apply two mark to all enemies targeting them. We could also do that with uh, a taunt thing and then utility belt. I'm fine with this. Okay. Let's go. I don't know if you guys saw the um, SNL skit that was based on kind of the, a poke at The Last of Us, but they redid, uh, like, Mario. It was actually really good. But maybe Pedro Pascal just makes everything good. Let us walk in silence. <laughs> My god. There was a Fraxia stream recently talking with one of the writers, uh, I believe her name is Emma, who handled most of Deadput's stuff, and she was saying how, like, it is a T for Teen game, so they would just kind of, like, submit certain things and hope it got approved, and, you know, more than often, more often than not, it did. old abandoned castle if that doesn't scream mambo cerebro i don't know what does Shh. first rule of relic hunting an old abandoned castle is almost never abandoned it's a good point we have hydro vampires up ahead acknowledged you think the vampires joined hydra or was it the other way around oh which reminds me Dear Hydra Bob, are you a vampire? The unicorn. Proceed with caution. No time to dilly dally. Of course. Well, guess what, everybody? <laughs> oh my god. I'm okay. He's with us. Okay. Defeat vampires and turned Hydra soldiers. Defeat all enemies, complete the encounter. Uh, turned Hydra soldiers can inflict bleeding with their attacks. Turned Hydra soldiers may become vampire minions when they're KO'd. Great. Question. Is blood-sucking abomination a higher rank than Hydra's power structure? They're all equally disposed. You're kind of dark, huh? They wear Hydra uniforms, but these vampires are only loyal to their hunger. Don't hold back. You all heard it. Grammy gave me permission to murder. <laughs> so, uh, invigorated, we have overpowered for two turns, so 100% extra offense, which is kind of insane. Um, if we could get his obsidian collar triggering next turn, that would be ridiculous. Like, he can delete enemies right now. Uh, but we also have the best defense shield bounce uh, combo, which would be kind of nice. Um, yeah. We did, we did get some quick shots here, which is helpful. What's the range here? I think we'll just take out... We'll take out these two, start getting an Enfuego stack. Okay, then I think realistically I should probably just go um, Wild Strike on a Deadpool target, then Last Sight on the other Deadpool, uh, and I say target, but I mean the one targeting. 50% chance to turn into a Vampire Minion. Ugh. Interesting. Because uh, then I've got three people targeting him. We can take out this guy. Your time is Let's see if he turns here. Awesome. That's fun. That's so fun. We'll do this. We have a box that we can take care of the other guy with if we want. We'll go last sight here. You have earned it. 
You were too weak for this fight. And then let's go Deadpool. I don't love that this is going to spend two. I maybe should have dropped the box and used a move here, but I'm not sure if that would have been the right call either. Hmm. We could discard and get the shove, but I don't think we need that. This is just, like, definitely overkill. But we're fine this for this round, so it's not a big deal. I will play best defense now. We lose some of the efficiency here, but I'll play it. Because I could, I could technically shield bounce twice next turn if I play another card beforehand to get the, the heroism. What's his block at? 205? So this could stack, too, after a couple shield bounces, maybe. Let's uh, let her buck. That was a pretty pretty clean first turn, but we could have taken down an extra minion there for sure. Oh my god. His annihilation right now? His annihilation right now? With, uh, with his current situation? I did not want to play that. I don't even know how that happened. That was weird. That's fine. We need the heroism anyway. Oh my. Look at this. Look at the damage on the hunter right now. I wonder if he can hit this whole group. He can hit those four. <laughs> so, I guess I'm going to wild strike here. Gain two more heroism. Why not? He could turn, though, so that could be a little messy. He did not. He did! Love that. Love that for us. Okay, so let's spend one here, getting rid of him. And then... <laughs> Wild. The Annihilation... Now, these guys could all turn, too, right? We haven't been super lucky here. But I need to kind of get rid of this dude as well. Let's just do a little shovey poo. Somebody call the meat wagon. And then if these guys turn, we can do a discard. And we can... Uh, Get rid of him that way. To get the extra shove. Nice. I wonder, maybe at the end of a turn, if they go down, they don't get the chance to revive there. Maybe. We also got the Enfuego stack, but if we go into a second thing, we lose all the stacks anyway. Would be red skull, I gather, from the you know, redness of the um, skull behind you. On our left, careful, and you be careful. Please, it's been a rough couple of years, <laughs> and I love you for who you are. A great man, my grandfather, a brilliant man. I worshipped him once, just once. Must not have been that great. More to our right. But at last, I have a new master. A worthy one. And when the ritual is complete, and the Magna Core ego is awakened, we shall... <laughs> Rude. <laughs> oh, is that my bad? Hold that thought. 
Oh, good. Hydra Bob's not a vampire. What were you saying about the mango gazebo? Enough blasphemy. End them now. Okay, what is her deal gonna be? Destroy her dark artifact. The Magna Corgo will regenerate health every turn. Focus your attacks to destroy the statue. 812. Okay, so he got some block there. He still has the collar, which is cool, but we don't have the cards here. Let's ditch this. Retribution. Attacking Sin will taunt random enemies. We have two mag dumps in hand. That doesn't really help me here. Boom headshot. That's fine, I guess. Does he still have... Oh, he doesn't... He didn't get to carry over that benefit from the... Um, from that other card, either. Okay, we're gonna do this. Um, we're gonna draw some Deadpool cards. See if we get any of those quicks. Those Got one. We have three people targeting Hunter. Two people targeting uh, Captain America. And one person targeting Deadpool. Let's do this. Let's apply the mark to the people targeting the Hunter. Okay. Then we can boom, or that we can uh, quick shot these. I could actually apply the weak here. It's just that it might mess up the the um, taunting and stuff. So I don't. Maybe that's not super worth. I just want to try to clear the field a bit here. Okay. Now, maybe I go all together now for our first card play, and then we can get some extra Enfuegos going with other people. Hey, there's our Mindbenders. Excellent. The dark heal I don't really need, but I can't do any redraws, unfortunately. I could do this. We just try and taunt everyone towards him. 50% chance to apply marked or 50% chance to apply vulnerable. Let's do this. And actually, I'll maybe just target one of these, leave one so that I could do like a, a boom headshot or a mag dump to get an easy and fuego build. Or maybe I should do both of those. Oh, but I, no, because I want to get one of these marked. I want to get, yeah, I want one of these to be lower. Um, or one of these to refund this card. Let's see how this will work with the taunt. Retribution. Okay. Taunt random enemies. This guy's already taunted, so that's fine. Um, I clearly don't... I don't love this, obviously, but I'm gonna do it here just to build in Fuego stacks. This is another thing with him that I wasn't considering before, is, like, being able to mark units just for him to get in Fuegos is pretty nice. Now I have a cheaper mag dump, and I could get rid of this guy. He's not marked. Uh, <laughs> I 
Oh, this will do it, actually, because he's at full health. We get that extra 120. Let's do it. And that's marked, so that's free. These guys still have... Let's see. Next ally ability kill. Yeah, so we still have one more. She's going after Captain America. That's fine for me here. Let's put the Mindbender on her. See if she can kill her buddy. So she's doing 103 with a big knockback. Not bad. She's weak here though, right? Okay, well, that's something. Um, I guess we shield bounce. There's a chance to add marked there. Takes out this guy. She's already weak, but I guess the mark doesn't even really matter then. That's not going to do it. This will. Yeah, let's do it like this, I guess. And then I'll put some damage on the, the totem. Oh, God. Fair. Fair, I guess. Going for the hunter. We could take him out with this. Does it say how much this recovers? 25%. Okay, so we really just want to save for, like, a big attack here. Right? So we'll do this. We'll get a card draw. We'll consume some block. Times like this, I miss fighting the Red Skull. And then we're actually up to, what, three in Fuego stacks now. So let's bring Deadpool... Let's get him out of the way, because if she's going for him, she's going to knock him back into something there. Or... Why don't I do this? If I put him, like... Over here, I don't know if she can... Hit that back wall or anything. Let's also put the Insidium, Obsidian Collar on. And we still have the Habanero Dart. And the Discard for an extra shove slash move. So I'm okay with this. That's fine. I like the new music. Best defense, okay. Over the years, Lilith's disciples have come in many forms. So... Let's do best defense. Roger that. I don't know if he can hit these three, but... They're not gonna like this. Maybe. Yes, actually. Or I could go for this. Put some damage on the totem, and then we can hit the totem with the uh, last sight. Someone order a I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. No mercy for the Let's see if this just ends things, or what happens now. That was the last of the charges. They won't be conducting any further experiments here. Okay.
This is going to apply two vulnerable. I'm fine with that. We won't draw two cards. She's not targeting us. We will also won't KO here with that. Um, let's maybe... Let's redraw the Dark Heal. Ooh. I don't know if we play this right now. This minion's not useful, and even if she hits him, it's it's really weak. Actually, I'm gonna redraw the hero combo here. All right. This just doesn't feel like that excellent. I guess what I could do is do something like this. Move Deadpool over, and then do the handshake into him. I'm going in. Get a card draw out of it. You wouldn't have lasted five minutes back at Camp Lee. Um. Okay, that's Still coming this way. fine, I guess. I don't know if we have a knockback here. He does have a counter, and he's got a ton of health, so I'm actually going to let this ride. And next turn, we can probably kill her with the vulnerable. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so when she's not weak... And she's hitting into uh, an object. Significant. Oh, that's neat. Is that a Hemalisk? She made Hemalisks. Huh, cool. Now, notice that that combo is just so strong when he's got that counter because he gets some of that block back. It's kind of wild. Um... I think if I move over here, we can hit these three. Uh, but actually, he's got this, so we should actually gain our block first. They're not targeting us, but let's do this. Oh, that actually moves us pretty close into position anyways. Now he can dish out more damage. He may even have enough to KO over here. Oh, I used the... Th yep, that's that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm going to Wild Strike here to apply the Marked. So that the Shield Charge will get that back. Lilith has sent you here to die. I hope you are... That's fine. They have not shaken their confidence. Is this overkill? Yeah. Have we ever used that in combat? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> 2200 block. Now, listen, I used to I used to really struggle with Cap, but like admittedly his his early cards are really rough, so there's just not a lot that you can do there. Uh, this is going to pop in one more Hard play. Um, I guess we're gonna wait for her to come up. Oh, boom headshots, decent. Mag dump here, it's pretty cheap. I think we're pretty set up for the next round. Can I do this to a Hemalisk? I can. But I need, I need, uh, I need more. I need more than this. 
Once it pops some uh, minions out, uh, it's going to reduce its health too. So let's just wait till next turn. They're sending in reinforcements. That's it. That's the reinforcement. And there will be no more time for heroes. What about anti-heroes? Or occasional do-gooders? I'm hard to define. You will not be spared. Fine. I'll get my own Mamba Gaspacho. Let's do this. We're going to apply weak to her. This thing's going to pop out some babies. So that's basically reduced its health by a third. Shield bounce over there is pretty decent. Realistically, I should I should put this on her. But I'm thinking I could do like um how do I want to play this? Maybe, uh, maybe I just ignore this. Let's go boom headshot. We're going to get three... Uh, get three heroism here. That's fine. That's fine. And this takes her, right? I doubt they'll take that beating to heart, but we can always hope. That's cool that she can summon up those hemolisks. I like that. And she's got that big, powerful knockback attack, similar to the, um... The, the things that shoot the tentacles. Revenants, I think? What? That's a little on the nose, don't you think, Cindy? <laughs> Whoa! Cindy Smart cannot be good for the old Lungaroos! <laughs> Caretaker, are you tracking this? Affirmative. Hold on. We're getting you out of there. Farewell, my friend. Yeah, okay, about that. Quick you. Seeing as oh I no! Destroyed Doc, uh, my unidentified Copyright. vampire with a Y, holy grail. Is it cool if I crash with you for a while? Friend? I don't think. A while? No. Not forever. No. no. 20, 30 years, tops. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, can I be in the sequel? Sequel confirmed? Eh? Huh? Do not fret. Kalagna Krigo was not crucial to my ascension. Rise, my child. We must prepare for the endless night. Dracula. Yes, master. Okay, so she's working for him. 
Very cool. Very cool. That was fun. And we, we got Deadpool to shine a bit. We got everybody actually shine there. Uh, the the 100% um, extra offense <laughs> for the Hunter definitely shined. It's pretty nuts. No, that's that's a real that's a really good that's a great team comp for him. You could substitute the hunter with somebody else, like uh, Strange, maybe. Okay. We need to talk to Daddy. Oh, Daddy Pooh! Oh no, is this? Oh, I've I've heard of this glitch. I've heard of this glitch. He's underneath the world somehow. And I need to look up to see if there's a solution. Because I don't know what it is. But he is... <laughs> underneath... <laughs> underneath us. I'm gonna... I'm gonna just check. You know there's that spot behind the abbey? I don't think that's where it is, but... He's even more down below. Damn. Okay. Well, uh, that's unfortunate. But I will... I'll reach out to the devs and see if there's a solution there. Um, I wanted to get his friendship to level 5. It's just going to... It definitely takes some time. That's going to be the challenge with these DLCs to get their heroics. Like, you just need to have... You have to do so many missions to get the hangouts. And uh, that's all well and good. If you're doing like a full playthrough, um, you'll do that over the course of, of the game. But if we're just focusing on this hero in a DLC setting, um, it's a little tougher to do that. So I'm going to see if I can find the solution here. If I can, I'll come right back. Okay, I solved it. Uh, I did. I tried to do a save and a reload. That didn't work. But then I just went around and talked to everybody they had stuff to say about uh, Deadpool and I saved and reloaded again and here he is so weird but we are able to see him you know what? well everything is out in the open now I'm fully exposed are you not worried about any repercussions from this doctor of doom if I think about it too hard yeah but lucky for me this dome piece is empty there's so much free real estate up here. How did you even get involved with him in the first place? Uh, haven't you listened to anything I've said? Money. Why do you have such a fascination with money? Whoever said money can't buy happiness clearly never owned a giant beanbag chair before. But you did not get paid for this job. How will you afford this bean chair? The five-finger discount, obviously. So long as you are happy with the outcome. Oh, I'm putting Merc stuff on the back burner. No freelancing. Just gonna work pro bono for the Midnight Suns. Did you know pro bono doesn't mean what I thought it did? <laughs> I cannot speak for the rest of the team, but it will be nice to have the extra help. I hope my heroics with the Magna Carigo back there bought me brownie points with the goody two-shoes around here. Destroying the Magna Carigo was the smart thing to do. Oh, <gasps> did you just call me smart? Well, technically, I made the decisions. No, I... Too late. No take backs. It's okay to admit that I make good decisions. Sometimes. So, what is next for Deadpool? I've got an exclusive contract with the Midnight Suns. Try to keep the chaos to a minimum. Well, that crosses off half the <laughs> things on my to-do list. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go make my presence known. How will you be doing that? Fireworks, balloons, gunshots. The huge. The huge. <laughs> I love how they spelled it. The huge. Wait, who wanted to talk to me here? Told you so. Hold on, I'm waiting to see if... Hunter, you have the same effect on vampires as microwaving fish does on the Avengers break room. I am clearing them out? 
You got it. New breed vampire activity has slowed down since you took the fight to them. We're making a dent. Should we throw a party? Nah, premature. I almost put up a banner that read, Well done slowing down the new breed vampires. <laughs> Go team. I cannot help but notice there is no banner. Too wordy. And I couldn't decide on a font. One thing is certain. Vampires are making the most of the chaos Lilith created. The good news? I see no signs that they're working together. Are you sure there is no connection? Just a hunch. Let's look at what we know. There's no crying over smashed vampire relics, but I wouldn't have minded adding the Magna Corrigo to our arsenal. Yeah, I know. Nasty artifacts like that aren't known for their safety features. Still, I wonder if Strange and Tony could have used it to make something useful. Hmm. We need every advantage. No Would have been cool. Would have been cool. It's how we've operated so far. That's not really my style, but neither is magic of any kind, so I'm trusting the experts. The silver lining here is that it blew up in Sin's face. She'll be picking the pieces out for days. That's a win as far as I'm concerned. I can agree with that. Anything else on your mind? What is a hemolisk exactly? It's an egg sac. But instead of cute baby spiders inside, you find fully formed new breed vampires. With enough time, a single hemolisk could generate an endless number of vampires. So goes the theory. How does it work? In a way that defies biology. A strange theorized they are creations of dark magic, and I quote, perhaps derived from the dark hold itself. <laughs> no need to mention I do a killer Stephen Strange impression, <laughs> especially not to him. Yeah, nailed no it. No promises. Thanks, Carol. Sure thing. I just had a thought that it would be cool if, um, sure. for these DLCs, if there was a... May, maybe you level these guys slightly differently. It's tough to do because you can integrate them at any time, but it would just be cool where for their final mission, you would have their Midnight Suns heroic. Um... I guess it, it would kind of break things if you're doing like a new game plus and all the DLC are there. And that's one thing I am looking forward to is, is doing a run after all the characters are unlocked. Because for, for instance, like Deadpool's, mecha or Deadpool's mechanic where he has um, the discard, Go right? Ahead. I'm listening. That's, that's like a major... That's a pretty major change, gameplay-wise. And then you have to consider, like, what you're going to research next, and your your researching uh, priorities are all different. How's it going, boss? Um, so a run with every character unlocked, all DLC, should feel pretty tangibly different building up. Okay, this is neat. We already have this on one, though, don't we? I'm pretty sure. We have a plus three. Huh, I could be wrong, actually. And Fuego on redraw, get a heroism here for boom headshot. You know what? I'll just take these both. And then we can compare. Until next time. Okay. Who's got the question? Oh, strange. Where are you? Where are you, doctor? Oh, he's hiding. All these icons are gone. Hey, can I ask a favor? I've developed a few recipes that have promise, if I do say so myself. Do either of those interest you? Two rares or an epic cauldron combat item? Only a true master of the mystic arts can make this. I'll take it. Thanks, Hunter. Select a hero they gain concealed. Eh, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Let's go down here. Overdrive is still out of stock. Utility belt out of stock. I really like this. Something I should probably have used a lot more. Okay. So, all together now, yeah, we do have one that gives three heroism, and this one is an extra move. So, this we don't really need. 
Let's get rid of that. And then, boom, headshots. We don't have any mods on these. So we could swap one of these in. And then we'd have to upgrade it. And I don't know how much, if we have any money. Ready to work? Uh, and we don't even have the attack essence. Okay, so hold on. Where am I at here? I only have 13 credits too, rough. What I could try... Let's see. Let's go to the old standing stones. It's been a minute. Legendary combat bonus. Okay, that's good. I want to see if we can get any gold, because I think Deadpool's up for training. Some gloss. Not exactly what I need there either. There we go. Okay, is that enough? I think we had 13. Let's go take a look. Read or die. That's what I've always <gasps> Think Doctor Strange knows Merlin. Let me see if I'm I can do a shield exchange here. Take this sword. Oh, yep. Actually, I backed out of that a little quick. See you soon. Central is ready to work. Punch the numbers. Well, this was educational and a terrible. This should keep someone busy. Okay. Avenger. This one has to be Captain America. I guess we'll send him. Happy to help. And we this one. Monkeys, I'd say send them out for the experience, but I think we're past that. He doesn't count as an Avenger. I'm here if you need me. Oh, one more day. Okay. Well, I don't want to spend the gold on this then. If that's going to become a tight situation. Do I have any attacks that I can ditch? Time to take it to the next level. Oh, you shouldn't have. I just realized <laughs> I might have an extra one of these. Yeah, my bad. Uh, okay, so we'll salvage this. We have one modded one. I'm not going to spend the gold to mod that one. Um, Good girl, Charlie. Let's take a look at the map because I don't know... I think that was the last thing for him, right? Seems... To, oh, wait. Yeah, no. Seems to be that that was his last mission. So, okay. Um, at this point, I don't know what we should do. Like, you guys let me know. If you guys want me to grind him out to get him to level 5, um, I could do that. I could also just run him through some missions off screen and then bring him back in when it's close to unlocking and then do his, uh, get his special ability so you can kind of at least see it in gameplay. Um, in the showcase that I made, it is really, it is a cool one. His animation's really nice. He kind of like keeps hitting, 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 and he gets so tired and you can hit, he just like 
gets out of energy at the end and just a final kick and it's really really nice um and it and especially when you pair it with his uh midnight suns thing which is like a golden kind of scarecrow it looks really cool but let me know what you guys want to do with that and uh and i'll consider all the options before i do another recording and then we'll come back and see what you guys decide Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the DLC run. And maybe there will be more depending on uh, any ideas that we get from the comments. And we'll go from there. Take care, everybody. Bye.